Harvard University is now enrolling for the January 2018 intake in the following faculties. The School of Education, BA, Adult Education, Early Childhood Education, Primary Education and Special Education. In the School of Business, we offer Bachelor of Accounts, Bachelor of Science in Logistics and Transport and many more. School of Agriculture, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture General, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture Animal Science, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture, Economics and Agribusiness. School of Humanities and Social Sciences. Bachelor in Development Studies. Bachelor in Mass Communication. Bachelor in Political Science. And Bachelor in Public Relations and many more. School of Natural Sciences, Technology and Engineering. Biosciences. Biochemistry. Bachelor in Nutrition and Food Sciences. Bachelor in Science in Forensic Psychology. And many more. School of Engineering. We have Bachelor in Electrical and Electronic Engineering and many more. In the School of Health Sciences, we are accredited with Health Professional Council of Zambia. In exchange programs for student transfer, we have Casemont International University in America. And our nursing program commences in January 2018. For details, call 0969-899-875 or 0979-966-615 or 0960-296009. Or you come in person at NPF Building, Cairo Road, 3rd and 5th floor. Or email Gideon Robert University at gmail.com. Gideon Robert University, breaking new frontiers in higher education. It's a lovely evening and welcome to my school or to all our viewers across the country who will come here to this exciting program, my school. We are talking Gideon Robert University, and today I've been joined in the studios by Professor Gideon Mwanza and, of course, the IT man, Mr. Kamfuat Sengamimboe. Good evening, gentlemen, and welcome to my school. All right. So now, Professor, we are looking at the, the January intake. How is it going, and exactly what programs are people supposed to enroll in? Thank you very much. Uh, the programs that are supposed to be enrolled are is Bachelor of Arts in Education. Mm -hmm. uh, most of them uh, you can come and you can enroll in that program, mm -hmm. online that program. Then in Development Studies, you can also have Bachelor of Arts in Development, stu in development Studies, mm -hmm. uh, Bachelor of Arts in Public Administration. Also, uh, issues of Bachelor of Arts in Logistics and Transport Management. Mm -hmm. yes, even at master's level, uh, we have uh, uh, even Bachelor's of Arts in Linguistics. Mm -hmm. yeah. At the MSc, uh, Bachelor of Science in Mathematics as well. We have such programs here. Also, uh, in health sciences, we have a uh, diploma in clinical medicine, okay. which is conducted at the Kaurishi uh, campus. Mm -hmm. But not only that, but uh, we will be introducing another program, which is nursing uh, program, which is going to be, yeah, to, to, to uh, the campus will be in Osaka, okay. uh, Cheston, Abbott. Okay, so maybe we, we, t we also look, you mentioned uh, the Kalulushi campus. Just how is it performing? Uh, for now, in total, in totality, uh, for clinical, we just commenced the program this year. Mm -hmm. uh, so far, we have uh, 120 students wow. who are learning at uh, the Kalulushi campus in mm -hmm. uh, clinical diploma. So, so far, so good. Okay. And uh, the environment is very conducive for learning. Mm -hmm. uh, it's uh, South Down, uh, Kalurushi, mm -hmm. just next to uh, Chuluma Mines. All right. Yes. So, okay. there's no joke uh, when they go that side, the, the lecturers are very much busy. Mm -hmm. uh, they even knock off around 21 hours. Wow, that's to commitment. Make sure, uh, that, uh, Yes, there's very much commitment. All right. Sure. Okay. 
So now let me come to you, Mr. Chisenga Um You are the IT man. What exactly is involved in this field? Okay. What is really involved in IT is about uh, making, let's say, uh, making education easier. Mm -hmm. For instance, uh, a lot of people face a lot of challenges in terms of accessing quality education. Mm -hmm. Now, as Gideon Roberts University, we decided to uh, develop uh, an electronic learning portal okay. whereby students uh, they can learn by just accessing our website. There are tutorials which have been posted, for example, the video our format, mm -hmm. yes, they are self-taught. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we are also taking advantage of the, uh, our free Wi-Fi that we offer to students mm -hmm. so they can learn 24-7. Okay. So what we are really doing is um, lectures, they prepare content, mm -hmm. and then we program them, mm -hmm. after programming them, and then we throw them on uh, our portal. Yes, uh, for those who are doing distance, mm -hmm. yeah, they can also learn, you know, school closes, mm -hmm. students can still learn and access uh, um, learning materials 24-7. Okay. Okay. So, Professor, is, is this uh, what makes uh, Gideon Robert University stand out? Uh, in fact, yes, though today the technology is... Uh, everywhere, but uh, what makes us to be unique is that uh, uh, for sure we will have uh, e-library mm -hmm. where students can access the, uh, the books as long they are registered with the institution. Mm -hmm. uh, we give them the student numbers where uh, they can access the books and study. Mm -hmm. So it makes us uh, different from others. There are other institutions that don't have such facilities mm -hmm. uh, in this 21st century. Okay. Not only that, but also we make sure that uh, our students, uh, they should visit these, uh, the, the websites mm -hmm. so that they learn is such a facility at Gideon Robert University. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about the online registration system, Mr. Singer. Yeah. We have uh, built an intelligent uh, online registration system because mm -hmm. we are looking at the challenges that uh, most students face in terms of like uh, trying to apply for a course. Mm -hmm. So as Gideon Roberts uh, University, they can access uh, the registration forms either uh, via Facebook, mm -hmm. via any social media. Yes, so what they do, have to do is to download the program, I mean, say the form, mm -hmm. and they just have to fill it in. And then after fill it in, they can submit the, the information right there. Wow. They don't need to struggle, saying, I mean, struggle in navigating our website, isn't it? No. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wow. That's what we've done. So the uh, intelligent uh, online instruction system is able to store students' uh, records. Mm -hmm. So if they want to if they, if they want to apply through WhatsApp, they can also apply through WhatsApp. Wow. They will receive the applications. Technology is really making things easy. Yes, it's really, really, really making it easy. Talking about uh, the Facebook page, Professor, how how is the response from the students or the would be students? Sure. Uh, so far, we have uh, uh, those who have liked the page. Mm -hmm. It's about fifty thousand. Fifty thousand for only two weeks. People have been visiting the website. So it means uh, not only just in Zambia, but world over, mm -hmm. people are busy to access uh, the Facebook. Mm -hmm. So we know that uh, yeah, uh, others they had the challenge in terms of uh, how to apply, how to download, but. Uh, this is the reason why we said we need to tell the people, the populace there, mm -hmm. that the facility is very much there. Mm -hmm. They can apply using like uh, micro readers or Yes. Yeah. So for those that uh, don't know our website uh, address, maybe you can uh, say it out. The, the Facebook page. Yeah, the Facebook page is Gideon Robert. Uh, 
visit mm -hmm. yes if you, if you just click and go through Gideon and Robert and visit mm -hmm. Facebook you will be able to find our website All right. uh, our Facebook our Facebook page. Yes. Okay, so it's uh, Gideon Robert University Facebook page. Please continue liking the page and uh, of course like uh, Mr. Tsangalungo has said, you can make online applications and submit to you all the requirements that are needed for you to be enrolled into this uh, institution that is breaking new frontiers into higher education. So now Mr. Tsangalungo, maybe we look at the advantages of having both the e-learning system and the online registration system. Okay, let me start uh, first with the uh, e-learning system. Mm -hmm. With the e-learning system, the advantage one is time efficient. Okay. Yes, it's time efficient, meaning where you're supposed to spend, let's say, one hour in terms of learning, mm -hmm. it, for it, it's only maybe 10 minutes mm -hmm. because you've programmed the resources. Okay. Yeah, they're computerized because they consist of graphics and animations. Okay. Yes. And secondly, uh, you don't need to travel because spend more time away from work. Mm -hmm. Yes, so even at work, you can still access, you can just sit down there, so, uh, use your mobile phone if you want. Mm -hmm. You can start learning from there. And again, our e learning portal, uh, we're also going to improve our learners' performance mm -hmm. in terms of like uh, the method we be used to program it. You know, in classes, we found something like uh, we've got slower learners, faster learners, and different uh, students uh, have got different assimilation rates. That's right. Yes. So with our system, they can stream live uh, videos, they can pause, they can play, and they can continue from where they left off. Okay. Then, when we talk about um, the sample learning system, it's also offline, mm -hmm. meaning even uh, we can, we, we, people can start using any device. They can start using their game consoles, mm -hmm. like uh, Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, or any device that supports audio and video file formats. Mm -hmm. So uh, for people who are doing distance, we can either send them a CD and be able to insert it in a, in a DVD player, mm -hmm. be able to play and listen to the lesson. Wow. Yeah. And then when we talk of, um, the online registration system, the advantages are one, it's quick mm -hmm. and it's fast. Meaning, and it's portable. For example, if I want to apply, I can just download an intelligent okay. form, put it in a flash drive, I can fill in my details mm -hmm. and then go to any nearby internet cafe where there's internet mm -hmm. and then just click submit. Everything will be submitted directly to our email inbox. Okay. We can also um, we can also attach files, band to attach, for example. We can also attach files in the same intelligent form. Okay. Yes. Um, people can um, apply through different social media. They say they can apply through Facebook page. Mm -hmm. They can just follow the link. Mm -hmm. They can also apply using their mobile phones. They don't even need a computer. For mm -hmm. example, those don't have access to computers. For as long as they've got the mobile phones, so right in the comfort of your home, you will do your application? You will do your application. Wow. So if you want, you can send it via WhatsApp mm -hmm. or via email okay. or any other social media. Mm -hmm. So integrated the system worldwide. Because, okay. you know, due to all this, to, to, I mean, due to changes in technology, mm -hmm. uh, people are accessing certain services, let's say electronic services like Instagram, people they are there for Twitter, people have Facebook, so we've taken advantage of such kind of technology. Okay. Yes. All right. So Gideon Robert University taken, taking advantage of the technology that is found in every home. You can do your application through online. We'll go on a break, but as we return back, Professor, we'll be looking at uh, you know the overwhelming response that we had from uh, the distance uh, students that were here during the uh, the, the August. Yes, August. Uh, uh, you know, learning. So we take a break, we'll be right back. Faculties, the School of Education, BA, Adult Education, Early Childhood Education, Primary Education, and Special Education. In the School of Business, we offer Bachelor of Accounts, Bachelor of Science in Logistics and Transport, and many more. School of Agriculture, 
Bachelor of Science in Agriculture General, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture Animal Science, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture Economics and Agribusiness, School of Humanities and Social Sciences, Bachelor in Development Studies, Bachelor in Mass Communication, Bachelor in Political Science, and Bachelor in Public Relations and many more. School of Natural Sciences, Technology and Engineering, Biosciences, Biochemistry, Bachelor in Nutrition and Food Sciences, Bachelor in Science in Forensic Psychology, and many more. School of Engineering, we have Bachelor in Electrical and Electronic Engineering and many more. In the School of Health Sciences, we are accredited with Health Professional Council of Zambia. In exchange programs for student transfer, we have Casemont International University in America. And our nursing program commences in January 2018. For details, call 0969-899-875 or 0979-966-615 or 0960-296009. Or you come in person at NPF Building, Cairo Road, 3rd and 5th floor. Or email Gideon Robert University at gmail.com. Gideon Robert University, breaking new frontiers in higher education. Gideon Robert University is now enrolling for the January 2018 intake in the following faculties. The School of Education, BA, Adult Education, Early Childhood Education, Primary Education, and Special Education. In the School of Business, we offer Bachelor of Accounts, Bachelor of Science in Logistics and Transport, and many more. School of Agriculture, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture General, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture Animal Science, Bachelor of Science in Agriculture Economics and Agribusiness, School of Humanities and Social Sciences, Bachelor in Development Studies, Bachelor in Mass Communication, Bachelor in Political Science, and Bachelor in Public Relations and many more. School of Natural Sciences, Technology and Engineering, Biosciences, Biochemistry, Bachelor in Nutrition and Food Sciences, Bachelor in Science in Forensic Psychology, and many more. School of Engineering, we have Bachelor in Electrical and Electronic Engineering and many more. In the School of Health Sciences, we are accredited with Health Professional Council of Zambia. In exchange programs for student transfer, we have Casemont International University in America. And our nursing program commences in January 2018. For details, call 0969-899-875 or 0979-966-615. Welcome back. In case you have just joined us, you are watching my school and we are talking Gideon Robert University. In the studio, I have Professor Gideon Mwanza and uh, Mr. Kamfuat Senga Lumbwe, the IT man that is giving us more information on how the IT is uh, you know, making things easier for you students to make your applications for enrollment into this uh, institution that is breaking new grounds for higher education. Uh, professor, we before we went on a break, we had uh, let's talk about the experience that we just had concerning the distance uh, students that came through. Yes, we had a lot of uh, applicants in terms of uh, those who came in mm -hmm. for distance mm -hmm. residentials. Yes, and uh, we had a very good experience in terms of uh, lecturing. Happy, you find that uh, this one was just uh, happy to say, you indicate it, mm -hmm. to say, ah, other institutions, they don't do things like this. Mm -hmm. But uh, why, how come here? Mm -hmm. So we said, no, we are unique in a different way. We are just giving the modules. But we said, here you have to meet the uh, lecturers mm -hmm. face to face so that uh, you can have the experience uh, where you don't have, uh, where you don't understand. Uh, you ask questions. You ask questions and the lecture will go an extra mile mm -hmm. so that you understand better. Okay. And uh, most of them, three quarters, uh, they are already in uh, teaching uh, fraternity. Okay. Yes, so meaning that uh, ah, they, they were very happy. Okay. It was very overwhelming. Okay, maybe you can also mention where they were being drawn from to come all the way to Gideon Robert University? Yes, as far as Chinsali. Wow. Chinsali, Kaputa, Kawe, Rusaka, Chipata, uh, Western Province, Southern Province, almost uh, 
the all ten provinces uh, they met here and mm. they, they networked. Yeah. In short, we say <laughs> the whole things, Zambia. Yeah, whole Zambia. Was, <laughs> the whole Zambia was hosted uh, here. Hosted. <laughs> sure. Wow. It was yeah. so busy. I, mm. I remember it, it was, was overwhelming and so exciting to see. Sure. You know, even people uh, because somebody might think that education has an age limit, but it was mm. so amazing to see the elderly people yes. getting back to school to upgrade their mm. academic uh, for, a, for example, there are three or four who are above uh, 65 years of age. Mm. They said education does not have an age limit. Mm -hmm. And we welcomed them and uh, they started mingling with the uh, young ones. The younger ones. Uh, and they are happy to say, ah, this is part of life. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, you're just telling me about the, the app that, uh, you know, you're upgrading. Let's talk about it. Mm, okay, thank you very much. I've uh, decided to develop an Android application. Mm -hmm. It's going to be the center of our e-learning system, mm -hmm. our online registration system, mm -hmm. so including our website. Okay. So with this application, uh, once the uh, students download it, mm -hmm. they'll be able to access uh, uh, all the services which they require. Mm. Yes, be, uh, they can be. They can apply just through within an Android application. Mm. They can learn from there. They want to access an e-learning portal. They can just uh, click on, a, say, an icon. Mm -hmm. Then automatically will be referred to our website where they can access such services. Okay. So let's talk of. Um, let's say they want to. To visit our e-library, electronic library, mm -hmm. yes, it's just at their own fingertips. It's just a single click okay. and will direct you to our electronic library. Okay. Yes. Uh, professor, mm. there there are many, uh, quite a number of uh, the type of uh, payment system mm. that uh, the students who are here and those that would want mm. can uh, access. Now, specifically, let's talk about the DDAC mode of payment. Mm -hmm. What exactly does it entail? Uh, for DDAC, it means those who are in the government. Mm -hmm. yeah, they can uh, apply when they, they come to Gideon Robert University. Mm -hmm. uh, they will sign a form, a uh, contract form, mm -hmm. where we agree. Uh, others, they pay within the range of 500. As low as 500. as low as five hundred kwacha. Mm. Yes, we are looking at uh, uh, to accommodate uh, almost everyone who is able to afford, not just to give an excuse to say uh, I didn't have uh, money to pay for tuitions or lessons. Mm. So we use government facility, which is uh, government payroll. Mm -hmm. uh, we were given the authority to to start de deducting or correcting. In fact, it's the government which uh, corrects the money mm -hmm. on behalf of Gideon Robert University, mm -hmm. and uh, they forward that uh, money into our account at a certain period of time. Okay. So that is what we call DDAC. Mm -hmm. So we, those who happens to apply to Gideon Robert University who are already in government. Mm -hmm. The civil servant. The civil servant, in mm -hmm. short. They have that opportunity. I believe uh, uh, very few institutions have that facility. Mm. And uh, we have the, that one for data, as well as people can pay in installments. Mm. We allow them to pay in installments, looking at the economic challenges that we are facing. Mm -hmm. So others they want it to be paid maybe in full but with us we have come up with a, a payment flexible. plan very flexible yeah. plan in terms of payments okay. so we say Gideon is here Gideon Robert University is here to welcome everyone in fact mm -hmm. uh, if I remember very well at the time of distance yes. uh, there are also some people like we call them uh, 
physically challenged. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, we allow uh, such people like, uh, let's say, Bonapiri was also here, part of the team. Yes. And uh, we accept everyone mm -hmm. uh, in whatever form we know how we nature them, we know how we handle them, but according to what Bonapiri uh, said, I uh, uh, can quote him to say, don't uh, over discriminate mm -hmm. uh, people who happens to be physically challenged. Mm -hmm. So we allow even people who are physically challenged at Gideon Robert University because we have facilities mm -hmm. that allow us to teach them. Uh, so it's not like uh, because one is uh, physically challenged, then he cannot or she cannot be, uh, she cannot go to school. No, that is not a reason. Here at Gideon Robert University, we accept everybody mm -hmm. because there's no discrimination. discrimination. All right, there is indeed no discrimination right here at Gideon Robert University. So if you are a civil servant, you have heard it. DDAC is there waiting for you. That's a mode of payment that you can pay as little or as low as a 500 kwacha deducted from your salary. And uh, you can find yourself right here at Gideon Robert University. Now, as we wind up, Professor, uh, do you have centers for this institution? Oh, yes. Gideon Robert University is uh, found in all 10 provinces. Mm -hmm. Uh, we have a center in Eastern Province, Chipata. Mm -hmm. We have a center in Southern Province. Mm -hmm. We have a center in Western Province. We have a center in Northern Province. We have a center or a campus uh, in uh, Copper Belt. Kawe Central Province, we also have a center okay. where people can uh, get that information in terms of uh, applying, like my colleagues has hinted already. Uh, you can apply within your house, as mm -hmm. long as you have a gadget, put the phone, a mobile phone. <laughs> so things a have- A smartphone. <laughs> yes, a smartphone. Things have, ma have been made very simple, closer to, to your mouth, mm -hmm. or in your house. Mm -hmm. Yes, right. I think we are all over the sure. issue. Gideon Robert University is indeed uh, all over Zambia, so that is not a very difficult thing for you to access us. You can uh, like our page on uh, Facebook. You can also use the e-learning and the online registration uh, system to get your application form. Maybe, Mr. Chisengalumbe, your word of appeal to especially those uh, students that would want to take up the field of IT. Uh. My word of appeal to those students who want to take up a field of IT mm -hmm. that uh, come to Gideon and Robert uh, University, mm -hmm. you never go wrong. You gain all you have. You have all the support from Gideon Robert University. As I, as an IT specialist, I'm mm -hmm. ready to give you all the support that you need. Okay. Yes. All right, Professor, your last word. Oh, sure. Uh, we may not forget about this item of buzzer. Otherwise, oh, yes. <laughs> we have come <laughs> to stay. People uh, who happens to be the potential applicant, mm -hmm. we have this facility for up to 2018. Mm -hmm. uh, as long as they have uh, what we call five O levels, mm -hmm. uh, we have slash out 100% uh, tuition. There's no tuition, but uh, just fees, small fees like for medicine, uh, medical fees. Mm -hmm just uh, to mention a few. Uh, ID, those are the things that they can pay. Uh, we don't want anyone to start tomorrow to say, hey, uh, me, I didn't go to school because of high fees. But for us, Gideon Robert University, we are saying, please, you are here to come and apply. Mm -hmm. Wherever you are, you can apply uh, to access edu education in Zambia. Mm -hmm. We, for everyone, uh, as long as you have five all of us. Mm -hmm. Yes. That indeed, on that note, that's the good news that somebody else has been waiting to hear. Basari, 100%. All you have to do is just come to NPF building, uh, fifth floor, 
of NPF building. You access uh, Gideon Robert University offices and of course on the third floor so that if you want to come in person, you don't want to do the, the online registration, you can come through and just find us right here for those that would want to access the buzzery, you know, bonus that has been given to you. Gideon Robert University is of course a supplementing government efforts in mm. ensuring that education is accessed by everyone regardless of age or ability, disability, you are all welcome at Gideon Robert University. Thank you so much for spending time with us. This has been my school. I was with Professor Gideon Wanza and the IT man, Mr. Kamfuad Sengarumbe. Until next time we meet, good night. University is now enrolling for the January 2018 intake in the following faculties. The School of Education, BA, Adult Education, Early Childhood Education, Primary Education and Special Education. In the School of Business, we offer Bachelor of Accounts, Bachelor of Science in Logistics and Transport,